So hi everybody, just showing you a collective haul of my eyeshadows. Um, and we'll start up here. I, I think if you ever watched um, my um, how I store things, you may have seen this. I got this at Winners. Um, it is uh, it is from. Uh, I don't know. I can't. I can't read it, but uh, I forget. Um, these are the sparkly eyeshadows that I have, and uh, as you can see, they've been used. My daughter. Uh, I've used them a bit, and I've noticed something about them. Like I noticed that the sparkles are just on the top, and you kind of have to mix them up. If you just take it off the top, then you're just left with a cream. So you do have to mix them around to um, keep all the sparkles in them. Or, like, you know, if somebody knows how you're supposed to do that correctly, you could let me know. And these are um, eyeshadows that were given to me. Um, I had... I have everything open so you can see the colors, but these all closed. Um, these ones, I really like them. They're just, uh, I think they're made in China or whatever. And uh, they're very nice. You can see that I use them a lot. This one is probably my favorite, the pink. And uh, yeah, so those are some. And these are my cream eyeshadows. I don't use them very often because I have oily um, skin at times. And uh, these are Annabelle. Um, this one got broken so it has to be careful. Um, I didn't open these ones as you can see clearly. And these are e.l.f. Uh, this is just like I'm missing one. I don't know where it went. And this is a L'Oreal that was given to me. It's like an orange, coppery orange, and you can tell that I, I like that. Um, it is a L'Oreal. And these are my LA Colors uh, shimmering powdered eyeshadows that I really, really enjoy. And this, uh, well, uh, this is a primer that I got at uh, Sh Shopper's Drugstore. It was a little pricey, but I I I I wanted it, and uh, it works really good. And you don't have to use very much of it. So for something like this, to pay what I paid for it, it's gonna last probably a year. So I think I paid twenty dollars for it. So and this is a palette, and it opens up and it has some. Um, uh, pow pressed powder in there and I really like these colors too I like this white a lot and the gold and um, the purple and these are my um, City Cosmetics palettes this one is the Paris one I gave um, some of these products away in a giveaway um, that one's Hong Kong and this one is uh, London and uh, yeah so I take the little brushes out of there because they rattle around when you carry them around and mess everything up so and this here is uh, my the newest one that I bought which I had a coupon for it is the uh, wet and wild um, this one's called pedal pusher I really like that one. Um, I like this side better. I tried this side the other day, and I, mm, I, I don't know. I maybe I just did it wrong. But these ones are um, uh, just uh, like a from China as well. They're just like mass made. They have a blusher, and these are all eyeshadows. I I took the lids off so you could see the colors. They are very nice colors. Um, this one I've used all up, um, use a lot of that one too, and then there's the, these ones, um, yeah, 
So that is uh, all the eyeshadows I have. And these right here are the only, well, besides this cre these cream ones that I barely use. This one I just got from iKate House, and I really love it. Um, it's gold, and you can put it under your eyes as an eyeliner. I don't know why it has red on it. Um, but I really love the color. Um, I will do a swatch. That is what the swatch looks like. It's very pigmented and pretty. And uh, it stays on. And I really just really like it. I ordered another um, bunch of stuff from iKate House. Um, and uh, yeah, so. And this is another one I got. And then I was very disappointed because I opened it up and I went to do a swatch and the tip broke off. And then I thought, how the heck? And I tried twisting it because this one twists and then you get more product out. But this one I tried twisting and nothing came out. So I think this one might, I've seen jumbo eye pencils that sharpen when they look like they're plastic. Somebody had told me they're hollow and that's all you get. But that just doesn't seem right to me. It's either a mistake. And it I can I think I feel something in there. So I think it might sharpen. I unfortunately do not have a big sharpener, but I ordered one. So I'm hoping this is gonna sharpen. Or I might just have to like dig it all out and put it into something. But uh it wasn't very expensive. Um I think I paid a buck for it. So it's not, you know, it's a very nice color and it's really nice on. And, uh, yeah, so that's all my eyeshadows. I hope you enjoyed this and we'll see you later.